I am Francis Soot, and I'm one of the co-founders of The Great Bubble Barrier. And with The Great Bubble Barrier, we combat plastic pollution. Uh, because every day, a full garbage truck of plastic enters our oceans, and this does not only end up in the entire food chain, but plastics carry toxins. And furthermore, uh, latest research has shown that it also emits greenhouse gases when it degrades in the oceans, like ethylene and CO2. So that's what we wanted to combat, like maybe the people outside, I hope not. Um, and what little people know is that two-thirds of plastic pollution in the oceans actually comes from rivers. Um, we are sailors, and we're, oh, wait, one back. We are sailors, and we have encountered this plastic in our rivers in the Netherlands very often, and I'm going way too fast. Something's going wrong. Um, and as friends, we decided we wanted to do something about this. Um, there's something not going right with my presentation, but I hope you all can still follow. Um, we saw abundant plastic already in Dutch rivers. Well, we have a very well set up waste management structure, uh, and we could only uh, imagine what the impact would be outside the Netherlands. So we were on a mission to combat plastic in our rivers, and that's when we started the Great Bubble Barrier. So what is the Great Bubble Barrier? It's basically a tube that you place on the bottom of a river. The tube has holes in it. You press air, compressed air through those holes, and you get a bubble curtain. A bubble curtain is basically air that moves up from that tube to the surface, and that movement brings along the plastic that is floating inside in the water. Um, when you place this bubble curtain in an angle on the river, like you see in the top view, you can use the natural current of the river to guide plastics to the side and to the corner where you collect and remove it. And in this way, we can collect plastic over the full width and depth of the river without hindering ship traffic and without hindering fish migration. So that's where we started from this concept. And after that, we started piloting. Um, what you see here is one of our major pilots. We've done four so far. And this was our largest one. It's a, a large scale open water pilot in the river IJssel in the Netherlands, uh, partially funded by the Dutch National Water Authority. And uh, the river IJssel is one of the branches of the Rhine. And we achieved very good results, much better than we <laughs> initially thought. Thank you. <laughs> so what we found is that we caught 86% of our test material in the river ISIL. Um, and combined with the pilots in our, uh, that we did before, we now know that we can collect material from one millimeter to one meter in size. And I'm not doing this alone. We started with the three of us. Our core team is now four, but we are actually already with a team of 11. We don't have a traditional role division, so you won't find the CTO titles, uh, etc., up here. Um, and we have uh, gotten quite a lot of traction over the past few years. So we started with a major prize by the Dutch National Water Authority, uh, but only last year we were awarded the Postcode Lottery Green Challenge Award, which gave us half a million in funding. Uh, which really helped us, and of course, the support by the Schmidt Marine Technology Foundation has also brought us a lot. Um, and what it brought us was to get closer to our dream. And our dream is to have a, an impact on global plastic emissions in rivers. We have started in the Netherlands, which is the delta of Europe, so good place to start. Um, and we are currently uh, deploying a few systems there, but we are also already working on our first systems outside of the Netherlands. We want to grow our team and pilot further, uh, but also grow our organization before we move towards Asia, uh, where eight of the ten most polluting rivers uh, are located. But we want to make sure that we have the right partners and the right uh, setup before we go there. Um, so if you want to help us uh, in this mission, please come find me. We are also upstairs. And you can also find us on the socials, of course. Thank you. Thank you.